our first winter here we got the pigs. They were really small, one boy and one girl, Magalitsa wool pigs. And their first housing was just a little tent-like shed, which they grew out of really fast. So uh, CERN started to make planks and I made the first walls for the pig house, which was movable in uh, five parts. Because our plan was to use uh, the pigs as plows. So here are the first house, as you can see, the next summer they couldn't fit in it anymore. And then the first babies. And it became a lot of babies. <laughs> the movable house served us greatly for several years while we farmed up the soil around the farm by our pig plows. Lots of babies later and uh, three years of plowing we had enough uh, soil to have more permanent uh, housing and we built the first pallet house at uh, the potato field. We chose to use pallets because we had a lot and it's for free and we like to upcycle instead of uh, using a lot of fossil fuel and uh, time to make planks or even to buy them, which we absolutely cannot afford. The pallet house was such a great success and the pigs loved it. Uh, so already the next winter we started on pallet house number two. The pigs loves this one too. And it's uh, situated at uh, the sheep's meadows in between three parts. So we can just move around fences and the pigs will have this house to sleep in while they plow the different areas around. So if you see in the background here is the new house, which this video is about. This new house is situated between two parts of a new vegetable garden. One which we have plowed with the pigs once before this year and the second part where the high house lies hasn't been plowed yet. I don't know if I will need the pigs to dig here with this really... Yeah, you're so good! My digging dog! <laughs> Hi, then.
هيا كده كمل يا كمل اه هدي بتي كده سيسه هي هي يا دي يا يا سيفي To make a waterproof roof, I will have this plastic on top and then earth and uh, grass on top of that. But that will first be in the summer time when the soil is not frozen. <laughs> It's a leftover roll after the root cellar project. Can we see the house? Down there? Yeah, you're on the move. When it's moving day, the girls are really excited. And so are we. Now we have just locked them in. Are you moving out? I thought you were moving in. <laughs> so today we have moved them all the way from the first pig house on the top of the hill. <laughs> They are checking out the new area, even though the ground is frozen solid today. 
After some years of plowing here, there will be no more roots or stones in the ground at all. Can you hear the ravens? They are sending a message to each other that uh, we have done something. Now we have moved the pigs, but they will also talk to each other if we are like taking down a big tree or anything, having guests even. Now we will leave them for their first night. Here, this area also will become a vegetable garden. Just have a few trees here left. Through the winter I will feed them to the pigs. So our non-fossil fuel driven tractors is now situated for the winter time in their new pallet house. Thank you for watching. Stay safe out there in YouTube land. Bye.